In this video, I'm going to show you how to go through the quote approval process. After requesting your quote, we'll send you an email with the details of your quote enclosed. Open up that email and you'll come to this page. At the top of your email, there'll be a PDF version of your quote, as well as a welcome package for the service you requested. If you open up the welcome package, It'll outline the services that we're providing. It'll show you the terms and conditions, and it'll answer many questions that our customers have had. To get a more in-depth detail, you could click the link provided, and it'll take you to our website. On our website, it'll go into greater detail, explaining our terms and conditions, and how our service is offered, and the features that are provided for you. If you have any further questions after reading through our terms and conditions of services, please don't hesitate to give us a call. Back on your email, you'll notice in the quote at the bottom of your screen is a green view quote button. Click this button and it'll take you to your client hub. Once you get to your client hub, you'll have a view of the quote that we've sent you via email. The quote will outline the quote number, your name, the address in which the work will be performed, and the phone number. Please check to make sure that we have the correct address to make sure the work is being done at the right property. It will also have on the right hand side the date that the quote was sent on, and once the quote is approved, it will have the date the quote was approved on. At the top you will notice that it is a waiting response. This means the quote has not yet been accepted. After reading through the quote, on the bottom of the screen, there's two options. You can request changes. Simply click the request changes button and then type in anything you'd like to have changed on your quote, followed by send request. This will update our files and let us know of your concerns and then we'll follow up with you. To accept a quote, all you have to do is click the green approve button on the bottom right corner. This will prompt you for a signature. You can opt to type your name, or if you like, you can draw a signature. To type your name, you can use the keyboard. Once complete, you can click the approve button. You'll be prompt that the quote is approved at the top of your screen, and the status on the right-hand side will be changed to approved. This will update our system and notify us of the quote being approved. We will then follow up with an email requesting that you provide your credit card. In the email, it will ask to provide your credit card if you do not have it on file already with us. If we already have it on file, you could ignore this request. If we do not have your credit card, please call our office so we can get your billing information straightened out prior to services commencing. If you have any other questions about how our services work or how the quote approval process works, please give us an email or give us a call.